Hello guys, today we're looking at a really, really cool power bank which you can take on trips if you're on holidays and trust me I've actually done this. It's a 10,000 milliamp hour power bank from Spilgut and it's awesome. As I said, today we're looking at the Spilgut 10,000 milliamp power bank with Qualcomm Quick Charge 2.0. Let's take a closer look. As I said earlier, this power bank does support Qualcomm 2.0, which means it will charge your phone up like ridiculously quickly if it supports it. No iPhone support this yet. If you have a Samsung phone, check your compatibility. And this power bank could basically charge your phone up in like little to no time, quicker than it could with the actual like wall plug, which you normally get at phones. It will charge at the same speed as a Qualcomm 2.0 wall plug which is awesome. I think you can get a full charge like within an hour on some phones. Don't quote me on that. That's what I've researched on Qualcomm. This power bank actually does something quite cool and efficient. It includes a lithium polymer technology, which means like you won't really lose charge if you leave it for a long time. It's more efficient at keeping its battery charged. Okay, this is a statistic for you. If you charge this power bank all the way up and leave it, it'll be good for up to three months, which is actually pretty cool. I was quite like pleased to hear this. Because I normally keep like, power banks on my cupboard for when I go on trips or when I go out for a long time. I just want to grab one when it's fully charged. I don't want to grab one like two months later and I was oh, it's got one bar left. I can't take this. And you have to worry about charging it overnight. Or I wouldn't recommend charging it overnight. That could be a bit faulty. But maybe you just want to go quickly. You don't want to wait a couple hours in your house for it to charge. So this will keep your charge for up to three months. So you'll be covered for any trips and things you just want to rush up the house and go to. Live your adventure with this power bank. But I did test it. So let me talk about my tests. So I went away for Friday, Saturday and Sunday and I'm back now. It's Sunday night at like seven o'clock at night. And this power bank, I challenged myself to only survive on this power bank for the whole trip. And it survived, like I'm a power user my iPhone success. It charged it seven times with one bar left from a power bank. So this can last you for a whole weekend if you're not near a power outlet. That's quite insane. So I, I accepted the challenge. I did it for the whole weekend. I didn't need a wall plug. I just went for power bank, that, that's crazy. Okay, so this is a neat feature I found out of this power bank whilst looking at my website before this review. You can plug the power bank in via micro USB, and then you can use the two USB outlets to charge two more devices. So you basically charge, so you can basically turn one micro USB cable into charging two things at once quickly with Qualcomm 2.0. That's just insane. So I didn't normally think you could charge stuff whilst you were charging the power bank up, because sometimes that could ruin it. This has cool lithium technology in it, so you can now do that. that that's, that's pretty cool. So if you're a power user of like maybe two phones, maybe like a GoPro and an iPhone, also having an Android user, so that's how you get the micro USB cable, you could charge your GoPro and your phone at once. That's cool. Now let's get to my favourite thing on this power bank. I've had comments from family members whilst I've been away, but it looks kind of holographic with the squares on the side, if you tilt it up and down, kind of looks carbon fibery but kind of looks holographic and that's quite awesome to me to be honest it stands out from a crowd not like a simple aluminium covered one or one which just one matte color it looks almost holographic if you press the button on the side there's four LED indicators running up the other side and each of these LED indicators is a 25% interval on how well your power bank is charged to tap the button one of that means 25% and so on and so on so you know easy at a glance how much charge your power bank has. So guys, hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, hit the like rating. If you're new here, click subscribe. And guys, I'll see you on Friday with a new video. Go and check out Spilgut's website, I'll link it down below. They do some awesome stuff like power banks, cases, like micro USB and lightning cables to charge your phone up. That's cool. I'll drop a link down below to their website if you're interested. Cool. And you can also buy this power bank on the website. So guys, have a great end to your week.